After the winter of 38 and the tornado that wiped out the farm and the, the family had to move out west. And life wasn't always easy, but we managed to survive. And we learned to, uh, well, we got the hay and the bushes and, uh, ah, but that happened like 70 years ago or something. Anyway, that's my Uncle Joe, and that's my cousin at Hoover Dam. And this is a story of my nephew Clint and his sister, uh, I can't remember her name. Good afternoon, Catch Penny Productions. What can you do for me? Oh, trying to reach Mr. Overwood, huh? You and everybody else. Well, hold on a minute. I'm looking for the man that's holding my sister in this here hell. Ain't anybody here who didn't come of their own volition. She came here with dreams. <laughs> Everyone comes here with dreams. Well, she's taking hers home with her. I think you'd better walk out the way you came in and forget you ever set foot in Catchpenny Productions. I think you and I better step outside and settle this right now. <laughs> There's no need for that. Dolomé is my personal assistant. Besides, she ain't here right now. I lent her out to Lenny at Sharon Pictures. I wouldn't do that if I were you. My friends here from the law firm of Jones, Huey, and Gringo will drop you the moment you draw. We ain't done. You wouldn't happen to know where I can find myself a whore, would you? Uh, at least a decent watering hole? Well, there's a bar just down the street. She's pretty. I'm trying to get her away from a rat named Overwood. Did you say Overwood? Yeah. Have some peanuts. I used to PA for Overwood. If you want to get to him, you're going to have to bust up a meeting. You know when he's having one? Uh, my case, uh, I heard that uh, something big is going down at Catchpenny tomorrow. Um, honchos from all over town. But you didn't hear it from me, my friend. You had it from her! Well, thank you kindly. <laughs> Woo! Mm. Oh. You wouldn't happen to know where I can find myself a whore, would you? on those who defiled my flesh and blood. Retro is in. Testosterone is in. Huh? What do you get when you put retro and testosterone together? Retosterone, huh? And what says retosterone better than Ted Nugent? Good day, gentlemen. Now, are we going to have to do this the hard way? Ah, oh, shoot. If we can nab Ted Nugent for the part, then we'll have that whole 1535 uh, Xer, rock the vote, WB, a single Who are you really, lawyers? <clears throat> well, all right then. I'm going to go in there and rescue my sister. Yeah, you know, it'll probably make a pretty interesting story and somebody might want to buy it someday. I mean, how about the both of you represent me if that happens?
internet junkie, coffee generation, tweeny demographic, right? In the back. Hey! George Lucas just put Star Wars merchandise and rights up for grabs. Gentlemen. No. Wait, it's a trick. Oh, gentlemen, please. Don't go. Don't. Idiots. That's it. No one interrupts my meetings. I'm calling you out. Things when you squeegee right now. Paper, no, I don't arm you and what? Oh, I gotta call that guy. Oh God, it hurts. Oh. Uh, I don't. Uh, what? Coming with me, Darla May. Yeah. I'm taking you back to the ranch in the Silicon Valley. Pa's got a nice little long line dating service you can be a spokeswoman for. And you. If you ever want a decent job and a more wholesome line of work, Stop this you just give me a call. What are you doing? You stopped this? <laughs> 